<laughs> you actually do spend a lot of time making your beds. And his rocket man's in there into the covers. <laughs> rocket man's in there. Because I see his rear end. <laughs> this one had a little blow up so tomorrow I'm just gonna get a needle and thread and fix that <laughs> y'all like those cute beds don't you you like those cute beds don't you well I've got a little bit of bad news I almost forgot um, our little two girls Bell and Betsy both tested positive for Chagas. So um, they'll start on their treatment as soon as they get the meds in. But they're still going to be up for adoption. Usually we want to have them on the meds for a month uh, before they get any kind of surgeries. And then they'll be ready to go to their home. They just need to be whoever adopts them just needs to continue their treatment for a year and I'm just like I said there's always a silver lining that's what I said with Zara if she would not have come to us she would have died from Chagas way before her time so now I've got two more I said I'm going to become not the mange mama become the Chagas mama <laughs> so the, the issue is that so many of the dogs that do have Chagas are actually misdiagnosed with heart murmurs, et cetera, et cetera. Chagas can cause and normally does cause heart murmurs. That is why it is so important to have your dog tested. Your dog can be on heart meds and it will not stop what the Chagas parasite is doing to the heart muscle. That's the problem. Unless you kill the parasite, the parasite will continue to do what it does. So, um, just found out today, Little Rocket is negative. So, there is no rhyme or reason. Um, and I'm just glad they're here with me. I'm glad they're here with me and they can get their treatment. Every time I give Zara pills, her pills, I say, you take that, Chagas. This is why when we were devastated in 2020, when we had puppies dying for no apparent reason, and we found out it was Chagas, we said, somebody knows something. So we are still testing every single one of our dogs. We're treating every single one of our dogs that comes in with it. And when they are adopted out as Chagas heart dogs, those people have basically committed to continue the treatment, to get with their vet and talk to Dr. Madigan so these dogs can live a long, healthy life. It's the same exact thing as testing for heartworms. Chagas has no symptoms. Neither does heartworms. Why do we test? Hello, because heartworms will kill your dog. Well, Chagas will too. Oh, I was looking off somewhere else. They got their new bed now, so it's a whole big deal. Anyway, I wasn't going to get on. Well, I said I, this morning I wasn't going to get on any kind of soapbox. But this made me get on a soapbox again. If you have adopted a dog that was brought to you from the south... And actually, that is becoming obsolete because they're starting to find them further up north. Um, anyway, talk to your vet. I'll post our website again. But especially if you have adopted a dog that was transported to you from a southern state, your dog needs to be tested for Chagas. Because if you do see symptoms, the sad reality is not always, but most of the time, it's too late. It's already done so much damage to the heart. 
<sighs> so, hey, 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 that's your new bed. Now I know who tore up that other bed. I know, because you got, got a little shredder. <laughs> Look how guilty. It's okay, honey. Because Brielle already had a hole in that one. Brielle already started that one. I just didn't think y'all would find it, and you did. The little bell found the hole. <laughs> so happy here in my bed. I like my new bed. Yeah. So sending love and hugs, everybody. I will put the link to our total Chagas information into the description. And you can look it up, find out what you need to tell your vet. There's actually a flyer there. There's papers there you can actually print to take to your vet. The more vets know about it, the more we can be able to save dogs. There should be no dogs dying of Chagas when there's a treatment plan. I will be also say that every single dog that started on our plan and has completed it has tested negative for the Chagas parasite. So, that being said, I'll go and then I'll post the link. <laughs> Love y'all. Say bye. Say bye. Yeah, there's my babies. I got my two. I got three little Chagas girls now. <laughs> I got three little Chagas girls. He's so sweet. Is my good girl? Oh, she says I can sit up too. We're gonna fix it, baby. We're gonna fix you all up. Yes. <laughs>